Okay, people, that's Gator at the Cable Company, and we're going to get, uh, um, we're going to go get a, a, a what do you call them, client, and uh, for the MLA uh, transport service. I just wanted to show you that I'm going to, uh, we're going to go pick up somebody to go give them a ride. Uh, they got to go to the, I don't know, I think that information should be private, I guess, you know. If you need a ride, uh, you know, I got a dollar a mile. It's uh, 706 599 1596. You can call it. Uh, please leave a, uh, leave a message if I don't answer. I got a lot of people call, calling my phone. Uh, and, you know, I got my number all over the place, so you got to understand that I'll call you right. I got to screen my calls. And, uh, but I'll call you right back, okay? Uh, unless I know your number. Got a lot of lineage out there, okay? You know, I got, I got people making claims against me about it. They can shut my. How in the world can you take my video off until you go to court? You know, you're innocent until you're proven guilty. No, not in today's world. They just do. Look over there, tell them a picture of the flag. Okay, the flag right there. See that? Okay, you, they disgraced that flag because they got one tent out there. We seen one funeral, and there's their funeral home, and they're going along with this bull crap, okay? Uh, and then all the, all the deaths, uh, what are they doing, are they, they cremating everybody now? Okay, we don't put nobody in the ground anymore? Okay, there you go. Uh, I think that's a, I think it's a disgrace to the flag every time, every one, every person that's going along with this and not going and checking for themselves what it's about, it, you're, you're disgracing that flag. If you had a family member die, well, you ought to be ashamed of yourselves. Uh, I, I'm not ashamed of myself because I know what it's about. I changed. I had no sense to go and check the shit out. Okay, I spent a lot of time. Well, maybe I'm retired, so yeah, I, I got more time on my hands than anybody else probably. But hey, you ain't been working either. You gotta go and look. You can look at the president. You don't see the president coming on no more, right? Because there ain't no president. You got FEMA. Uh, FEMA's in charge. And. Uh, uh, I'm glad you guys to come and see me today. Uh, just hang around, and uh, we're gonna we're gonna do a lot of good shit. Okay, um, I can't get this out of my mind. I don't keep telling you, don't be an organ donor. Get that off of you. Uh, Lacey said her soul be free. Just one of you out there. We don't have no country. Uh, we don't have no. I can't pass the bill. Uh, we gonna have to uh, just get one of you to change your mind. That'll help her soul. That's what it's all about. Uh, that, it, that it's gotten more than that now because you know I don't want to see anybody lay up there on that bed with fifty four thousand two hundred and one dollars worth of drugs going through you and you ain't got no say so over your body part. They're not there to help you. Life we can get your number, you're gonna die. That's their job. And they're organ harvester. They went to school for that. They don't care about you, man. You ain't got money to pay that dang hospital, they gonna take your organ because they did everything against them. They did they violated Lisa's constitutional rights. They violated my constitutional rights. Uh, you know, people don't understand that. Right, well, that's what the cable company's for. It's going to have an entity there to say, hey, man, come and help me, man. You know, they violated my rights. Well, the cable company's going to be there, man. We're going to go down on them and we're going to check it all out. Yeah, we'll get slapped in the face and, you know, people will be doing, you know, bad things. And, it'll, you know, it'll come, it'll come all out in the wash. You know, like Bill Gates. Or, I just don't think you got time. I don't think you're going to have time. They're, gonna, they're doing this and they pull the wool over your eyes. Everybody's still got their mask on. You see the social distancing. This is bull crap, man. i tell you what, the next time we have a damn, it'll be an epidemic then. And you'll see people falling out of shit, okay, and dying. I mean, for real, man. And uh, and I'm going to be telling you, you know, get social distancing and get out of the house. Shit. You know, you better get under the ground, people, in the, in the ground when in a bunker with air tanks and a mask, gas mask. Think about what I'm saying. You know, they have a lot of different. You know, I'm telling you the truth, man. That's what, that's the only thing I can do, man. The only thing you got is your word. And I, and I, you know, I wish, I wish that I was wrong, man. I really wish that, you know, everybody I could come out and say, hey, you know, I, I'm really, I'm really sorry for, uh, you know, the, the poop.
pull, pull the wool over y'all's eyes, you know. But I'm not. I'm basing, I'm basing my, I'm, everything I tell you, oh, because at Harvard, Harvard, you know, the Harvard did, was offered $40 million. I'm going to tell you this. And uh, I don't give you call it copyright or whatever. I, it's, uh, uh, it's a true thing. They don't need the money. They don't want the money. They turned it down because they didn't want to be controlled by the, the government telling them that they got, this is the way they got to teach. You know, I don't know. They got thing. Uh, you can go and find that, uh, find that one class and, you know, it's pretty long. Uh, the guy uses the chalkboard. It's real good. It's really good. And uh, a dumbass can learn, okay? You can, it's out there. They ain't got it taken off yet, but they will. They, they buy They don't, you do not have any rights. Your rights only came by, uh, well, you say over there by God, inalienable rights. But those inalienable rights people were put down on that Constitution. And when that Constitution was suspended, I don't know, I'd say this a million times. I don't know how to tell you any different. You don't have a Constitution. I'm just going to have to show it to you. Uh, I've got to do this transport real quick, and uh, i got to get this guy somewhere back. But uh, as soon as I get over, I'm going to go and uh, we're going to go get and find us some free Wi-Fi. And, uh, you know, I'm going to look this up for you so I can show you what the hell your, your government has done to you. Okay. Well, right now, you don't have a government. All you got is FEMA. All right. Just, hey, don't blame me. Check it out, man. Hey, I dare you. You know, it's like I double dare you. I double dare you to go and check it out. Go look at the, go look at the laws on the books. It put FEMA in charge after the natural disaster. Uh, the tanks are still in place. The combat ready soldiers already been in combat in Iraq and Syria. Uh, they, they're ready. The tanks are in place. You can't. It takes, uh, it don't take nothing. That was that show of the National Guard leaving. That's our own guards anyway. They're citizen soldiers. They stay with us anyway. Uh, yeah, you know what? That's, they're supposed to stay here with us. We got them in each state. But them, them battle, that battle platoon, you need to put them back out there on the thing, on the border. Put them back outside. Get them off this land. That's against the law to have that, 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 our troops with the intention of taking over its own population. There's something wrong with that, man. Y'all don't see it. You know, well, you know, wash your face. Get away from the TV. Turn that kid thing TV off. And uh, do something else, man. You, you, hey, a couple of days to go away. As long as they can't keep flashing you. They gotta keep flashing you. A big event coming. Oh, it's an emergency. It's a tornado. Okay, well, it's them zapping you, okay? They done created the damn shit. Hey, I don't know how to you got to, got to see it, man. You know, you don't, you don't believe it. You want to believe everything they say. Okay, well, you're gonna die then. Okay, there's nothing I can do for you. It's gonna be too late for you then. Right now, we can have 350 billion strong. We can pick up the telephone, tell them to them fix the shit, and we can fix it. Uh, you know, you can't fix it when you get, when all y'all get, you'll be zapped. Okay, there's only, only a few out here that's not gonna them, not gonna take it. We're not going to get sick because we're not going to get injected with it. Unless you get, unless they got anything thing that they can touch you, you know, and then you're got, you know. Uh, that, that could happen, you know. Uh, they got some serious shit out there. Uh, that just wasn't it, okay. Uh, it was an experiment. And it's gone, and it's gone, it's gone beautifully. I only, when I was a kid, I, I heard this speech about the One World Order. Uh, there was one, there's one first resistance, they're supposed to back off, there is no more, you know, you know, oh, it's locked down, they don't really, no, they will not do it again, they will not back down again, the next time they're going, they haven't stopped yet, really, uh, but, uh, you know, they took, oh, they showed us, they showed us they're leaving out with the military, everybody's happy about that, uh, they didn't show me anything, uh, if you know what we did, how we did, uh, we took down Iraq. We did it in like three days, people. They moved all them men, all them equipment. It was equivalent of everything in California. They moved it over there in three days. Okay? Uh, tell me they can't bring the National Guard back. You didn't make me feel better at all. Uh, you want to make me feel better? Get rid of FEMA. Dissolve FEMA. Put your National Guard in place of it. Uh, that's law. That would be, that would be law. Congress gets your shit together. 
you Supreme Courts, do the right thing, man. Stop doing this crap. And, uh, you know, that's, and I, hey, the President, take the damn oath again. You sorry bastard. You hear me? You make me disrespect my goddamn presidents. I don't like that. Dirty fucker. I, I don't mean to get mad, but you, I, I got a lot of spirit and a lot of heart, and then you took my goddamn girl out. That's wrong. You ain't got no constitution, people. You ain't got. They, this is just a joke, right? I don't. I don't want to die like this, right? Without telling you. At least I know I done told somebody. You know, I tried to stop this crap from happening. Okay, y'all come on back, man, and uh, see me, okay? All right, you love it.